So what does the day of a typical medical student even look like? Alright guys, what is going on? Lux here from the MD Journey, helping you succeed on your medical journey with less stress. Today, I'm going to be doing something a little bit differently and I'm something that I want to do more of. I'm going to call them my three minute Thursdays. Essentially, I'm going to be answering your questions from the comment sections, emails, social media, and putting them in a very easy to understand video that's also very quick. So let's get into this video, three minutes on the timer. And today's question is what the typical schedule of a first or a second year medical student or a preclinical student looks like. So I'm going to basically run you through what my schedule looks like. That's going to be much different from a lot of you guys, but you'll get the picture. So let's get into it and we're going to put the schedule right up here. So my typical wake up time during my first two years of medical school was, wait for it, 4.30. Now I know a lot of you guys are like, this guy's crazy, click off the video and not watch it. Bear with me. So I was already an early riser, wake up at six o'clock. What I realized though, is that I was still studying too much and basically studying all the way to nine or 10 p.m. into the evening and then immediately go to sleep. That was like dreadful. I was stressed out and not enjoying myself and had no time for what I felt like was free time. Um, I would basically have to go to sleep right after finishing study. So to wake up a little bit earlier, blog post uh, in the description to understand how I did it, and then basically made my natural waking up time at 4.30. Now from 4.30 to about six o'clock is when I do my morning routine. Um, made a whole video on that, so you guys can check that out down below. Um, and I would do it to six because six o'clock is when the gym would open. Um, I'm really big on making sure I take care of my body, uh, but I don't like taking care of my body when everyone else is also at the gym. So six o'clock is a great time to get to the gym when no one else is there. So from six to around 7.30, I would do my morning workout um, for the day as well as take my shower. Uh, class usually would start at nine. So from about 7.30 to nine, I would do my review from the day before. So if it was Tuesday, I would review whatever um, it would be uh, on Monday's lectures. Now lecture would start from and go from nine to 12, typically at my institution. Um, and they allowed us to stream lectures. So I typically didn't go to class because I would watch lectures a little bit faster. Um, video down below on speed listening if you guys want to check it out. So from about nine to 12, I would wait till the lecture came and live, I would watch it. And then during the rest of the time, I was waiting for the next lecture to come. I would review that lecture and start creating my flashcard. If you guys are interested, and learning how I studied in medical school, video also linked down below. Now I would do the streaming and reviewing anywhere from nine to 12.30 um, and then kind of have lunch uh, and depends on how the afternoon is scheduled. Sometimes you have lab as a preclinical student like anatomy lab or pathology lab um, from like one to five. So your afternoons are also booked. And sometimes you may have a free afternoon. So then it depends. So if I had a free afternoon about 1.30, I would get home and from anywhere from 2 to 4.30, I would review the lectures from the day. Remember, I've already done a little bit of review because I've streamed the lectures faster. So now I'm basically doing more review for about two hours. And then from about 4.30 to about 6 for the next hour and a half, I'm just preparing for the next day. I'm skimming the lectures, I'm making my flashcards that I can review the next morning and just kind of getting everything geared up. But at about 6 o'clock, 6.30, I'm usually done if there's not any lab. Now, if I did have a lab, I mean, the lab typically ended at 5, then from 5.30 to 7.30, I would do my first review of all the day's lectures. And then with whatever time I'd have remaining, maybe from 7.30 to about 8.45, 9 o'clock, I would go ahead and prepare for the next day. Um, lab days, you typically don't get a lot of much free time, which is okay. Um, and I would use those last few hours before bed, which would usually be around 10.30 to watch a TV show, catch some Xbox, um, Skype home, whatever maybe makes me yummy dinner. And that was basically what a typical day in medical school looked like. Now I know I went through that quickly, but I promised you guys I would try to do it in three minutes. So hopefully I got there. If you guys have more questions though, you want to know kind of what the daily life of a clinical student looks like or what a fourth year med student looks like, what a resident looks like, I'll make that video pretty soon. Just let me know, comment down below in the description. If you want more videos and you want more three minute Thursdays, comment down below with your questions so then I can answer that in the future. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, hit that subscribe button, I think it's right there. And then I will see you guys in the next video. Take care my friends.